All right, this is a Dynatech coil kit. I have the parts laid out. It's kit number DCK7-6 and everything on the uh, instructions here is located in the kit. <clears throat> and uh, this is how you put a Dynatech coil kit on. First remove the Yamaha coil. Two bolts holding it to the frame. Disconnect the wires. Disconnect the spark plug. There we go. And then we're going to reuse the spark plug boot. So you grip the wire right behind the boot. Then you unthread the spark plug boot. There you go. You're going to reuse the spark plug boot with the Dynatech supplied wire. You push the wire into the boot and you thread it on clockwise until it gets good and tight and you feel that the wire is bottomed out. Right about there. Then you can uh, plug that back onto the spark plug. The original wire was held onto this emergency brake cable. Take that off and either pry it open. There we go. Pop that little clip open. Stick the wire through there. And you're good. Alright, so the wire is positioned as so. When I looked at the Dynatech directions, it has a nice picture of the coil with the bracket, put the coil with the spark plug tower on top, and then the bracket on this side, just like the picture shows, and you use these two bolts, now those are the originals, you use the longer ones that came with the coil kit to go through the bracket and through the coil, and a flat washer, and a nylon locking nut. Same thing to both sides. And the only tool you need is a 10 millimeter wrench and socket. Tighten the coil and the bracket together. Torque, and then you can put the coil bracket to the frame. And put the uh, original screws that you removed back in. Take them down good. Work on each one and connect the primary wiring. You will need an adapter that goes onto the orange wire, which is the coil negative, which goes to the terminal without a red dot, and the brown wire with a red stripe goes to the terminal that has a red dot right here on the coil. That's the primary wiring. The secondary wiring is the spark plug output, or the output to the spark plug. You push that on good until it makes a snap and push the boot up. And that's everything. Now you can start the vehicle. Oh, and also if you have a Dynatech ignition, you would uh, attach those wires to the coil also uh, as shown. 
the brown with the red stripe goes to the brown with the red stripe of the ignition. It's a piggyback connection. Plug that onto the terminal with the red dot. And then you unplug the orange wire and uh, unplug the adapter. Plug the orange wire to the orange wire. Then the other wire that you're left with is an orange with a black stripe. And that one does need the adapter. Just plug that onto the adapter. And the adapter onto the coil without the red dot. And that concludes the wiring of a Dynatech coil kit with a Dynatech ignition.